Uh, hello there. I wish you all a fantastic day. I hope you're having a good one. Um, and yes, hello wherever you may be watching this. Today's video is going to take a slight turn and it's going to think it's flipped back and forth between my usual things of allow the love that you feel in your heart to basically be the grounding force through your darker times and a mix of why when we set ourselves to do something, even if we don't feel like doing it, why should we do it? And it kind of how being consistent in the face of not wanting to do something, just putting it out here for today. I mean, doing these, doing this now, not feeling the greatest, not feeling how I normally would, not my usual enthusiasm. Feeling a little bit ill as well, not like me. Uh, just wanted to say, even if you may not feeling the greatest mind you may not feel you're putting out anything decent at least record it watch it back is it worth it post it because there is a message in you there's a message in all of us that the world needs to hear it might not necessarily be through a video like this it might not necessarily be direct talking to someone but writing audio drawing painting there's a lots and lots of creativity that can come from just doing something daily and consistently now what I was originally going to sort of wanted to do today was kind of talk about how say the power force that love can be in your heart when it's focused on yourself and your message that you need to bring out but also say how the darkness is there to ground you to sort of um, mould you so then you can shape yourself and project yourself up. Um, when I talk about love, this is an image I like you to kind of think so look I mean, how, how we react when we all see a newborn baby, that pure innocence, that pure joy, that pure abundance, purely because there is, there is, you know, it, it's, it's a new baby, there is kind of nothing but pure innocence, and that's what it beams out, and it allows us, the love we feel, to kind of project that, and no matter how you're feeling, whether it bad, good, when you see that, and that look into the eyes, your heart melts, your heart just melts of, oh, the beauty. Oh, yeah. so we have access to that all the time within ourselves. I think a lot of that we are kind of searching to go back to the source from which we came from. A bit like when maybe you first left home. When you first left home, you're kind of like, yay! But at times you're scary. At times you weren't sure if it was the right decision. At times, it's bloody terrifying. What was for me at times because I've got myself into a lot, a lot of problems. <laughs> but you grow from them, and that's why I feel we're here. We're here to go out there, grow, bring the knowledge that we have and we learn in this life, and then bring it back to then. Well, I don't know what the afterlife is. You know, I don't know if there is one, but I have faith that there is. Bear with me a second. Uh, on that subject of um, the same about the other life is isn't who knows but something obviously we have an awareness of everything that exists everywhere we just don't know it in the same way we have access to the vast space of the internet and then it's kind of singled down by Google we type something into Google and we get a list of our pages and then from one click very good. Got the, we got the sort of information of what we were looking for. So basically, we get that knowledge from the web page. We fill it to our awareness bubble, and then we have a knowing. And that's how I feel life works. Life is in the internet are quite similar in the awareness, the knowledge, combine it together. We get a knowing of an understanding, not a knowing. Sorry, kind of rambling on a bit. But what? What I'd like to just sum up is basically if you feel you want to do something, do it. If you don't feel like you want to do something but you know this thing may work so you can move forward. Let's say six have a task that I'm doing, one video a day, whether you feel like it or not, whether it's the intended one you're meant to do or not, one video a day. What's the worst that can happen? You post that video, no one watches it. You post that one the next day, 
then the next day, the next day, then the next day, and it just it grows. Um, so I'm just gonna, I, just if I may, this is um, a quote that I'd just like to end on to kind of summarize up this whole thing. Actually, as I said, even feel the love in your heart and allow the darkness to balance and ground you. Realize that being a human being was a choice your soul made at the moment of your conception. Think about that. Um, please feel, please comment, like, and subscribe, and let me know what you thought of this video. Uh, the subscribe button will be here, and there'll be a link to another video in this little bit here. Um, please tell me what your thoughts are on the. Actually, how about this? Tell me what your awareness, where, where your awareness is focused at the minute, and what knowledge would you like to put into that awareness? Please comment down below. Thanks very much for listening. And uh, your feedback is greatly appreciated. You have a good one.